Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. This is my 100th lecture. Today I am going to discuss about radiometric correction of satellite imagery. First of all, why needs radiometric correction? Radiometric correction is an essential step in the processing of satellite imagery since classification is performed based on radiometric value. The process of radiometric correction includes two things, one atmospheric correction, another sun elevation correction. This process is necessary if measurements are taken from multiple sensing platform, such as the combination of Landsat 5, 7, 8 and Sentinel-2. Also, this conversion is necessary when satellite measurements are directly compared to physical measurement on Earth. Because if you have two images in two different time series, then the sun elevation will be changes. Like I have downloaded two images, one for 2021. See this metadata. Here the sun elevation, control F, type here sun, find next. See this one, sun elevation here, 40.672065.9 degree. In the same pattern row, see this one, pattern row, 138.42. In the same pattern though, in another time frame, it is 2014, click it, see this one, same pattern though, 138.42, but here sun elevation is defined. See this one, sun elevation 54.9360.9694. That's why we need radiometric correction. Now, you can see this one, this website, it is from USGS. You can see here, Lancer Collection Level 1 data can be rescaled to top of the atmospheric reflectance and our radiance. So now question is that, what we do? Reflectance or radiance? Radiance means what? Radiance means, radiance is the variable directly measured by remote sensing instrument. So it has one unit, this unit. But in case of reflectance, it is the ratio of amount of light leaving a target to the amount of light striking the target. So it is a ratio. So there is no scale. So you can find formula here for conversion direct digital number to TOA reflectance. That's when top of the atmospheric reflectance. Here you can see here the formula for conversion to TOA reflectance. Here, this one formula, MP. MP means multiplicative band X. And here, QCAL, that means DN value. And AP here, AP means band specific additive rescaling factor. You can find this one in metadata. Like here, MP reflectance multi band X. And for AP reflectance add band X. And QCAL means here the DN value. So, for sun elevation correction, we need to use divided by sin phi sun elevation SM in here, sun elevation. You can find this thing in, in the metadata. Here, this one, the metadata, you can find here. Radiometric rescaling, this one. Radiometric rescaling factors, you can find radiance and another reflectance in case of reflectance this one reflectance multiplicative band 1 to band 9 so we'll use this thing for our analysis and also here the reflectance add band that's mean additive band 1 to band 9 so let's convert it in arcgis here my arc map this is add data I am adding this Lancet image from band 2 to because we, we basically need band 2 to band 7. Select all band 1 to band 7. Add all. Yes. 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 Okay. Now I am adding my study area map here. This one Aliputu district. This one. So now this is select features tool, just select it, 
now go to windows tab click here image analysis select first one press the shift button and press last one now you can see this tool this tool mean clip tool just press over here now this is clip according to my study area so no need this previous version so just select first one press the shift button right click remove all this is my lancet 8 image so no need this one just click over here so this is lancet 8 for 2014 okay now next step open your actual box now go to special analysis tool here here the map algebra this one and you can find raster calculator double click over here you can add one by one but you can add right click and open base you can add here add row at the six band so add six row two three four five six now see this metadata reflectance multiband this one all are same 2.0000 e minus 0 5 in case of reflectance add band it is also same so see this formula for conversion dn to toa reflectance mp so here the mp mean this one this value Let's take a copy it is same for all the band so paste here control b again multiplied by qcal qcal mean here dn value so plus ap so ap mean band specific additive scaling that's been this value it is also same for all the band take a copy and paste here okay so it is minus so plus minus mean minus so here the value this value take a copy go to raster calculator double bracket control v that's been this value into dn value that's been this one it is for band 2 close this bracket now copy this value copy this ap value and paste here okay close this bracket divided by sun elevation you can see this value divided by sun elevation sine sun elevation so we need sun elevation now here you can find sun elevation 50.936094 degree now we have to convert this one into radians because it is in degree so here radians radians mean is equal to this value into pi give a bucket divided by 180 degree enter this is degree sun elevation in degree this is sun elevation in radians now we have to perform sine so sine sine theta mean here sine theta that's mean this value enter just take a copy divided by this value Close this one now click OK so here this is the output raster you can change your output raster just open your base change the output raster yes you can change your output raster Lancet Two thousand fourteen zero three twenty one.
this one give a name radio metric correction so radio metric band 2 dot tif and for raster data extension is tif save it now click it ok now again right click fill the bash again right click here fill all now we have to change this band name from here first one for band 2 second one band 3 band 3 now this one band 4 band 5 band 6 and last one band 7 we have to change name in the output raster also here first one band 3 4 5 6 7 just click it ok it will take some time so it is done this is band 7 now we have to add others band let's set this one 14 now see all the band 2 to 6 add here so see these differences one by one i have already said radiometric mean this is a ratio scale so their result 0 to 1 so here the value 0 0.08 here the value 0 0.28 but in case of dn value you can find it is a integer value again see this one this is band 3 it is also 0 to 1 and here the range is another value because this is a digital number in this way you can convert digital number to reflectance also you can correct it sun elevation and atmospheric correction thank you viewers for watching this tutorial please subscribe my channel